If you just got the new iPhone 17 Pro or Pro Max and you wanna get video that looks this high of quality without any color grading or needing to do really anything complicated, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. Let me go ahead and grab my phone real quick and then let's switch to this top-down angle right here. I'm gonna go ahead and end that recording and we're gonna go into this. First of all, this is an app called Black Magic Camera. This is what you're gonna want because it's gonna allow us to control every single thing on our camera and actually lock it in as if it was a professional mirrorless camera. Now from here, there's really only a few things that we need to change. We're gonna go into the settings and under codec, we're gonna choose Apple ProRes 422 HQ. If you want smaller file sizes, you can actually switch this over to HEVC and it will still all work. From there, we're gonna choose the resolution of 4K and then we're gonna actually choose the color space of Apple Log 2 HDR. This is gonna give us this log look, which makes everything almost like gray and washed out, but that actually allows your camera to record way more color data. And the next step is us converting it with something called a LUT, so that once we turn that on, it actually has the normal colors again, but we still have all that extra data. To do that, all we have to do is go back into the settings. If you wanna record vertical video, make sure you also tick this on, which is enable vertical video. Then we're gonna scroll way down here to where it says LUTs. We wanna make sure that we turn on record LUT to clip. This makes it so that we don't have to color grade later, but if you're someone that wants to transfer your footage in the highest quality possible to edit on your laptop, then you wanna check this off, that you're not actually converting those colors in your phone, and you're able to do that in your laptop, which gives you a lot more control. But again, right now we're going for ease of use and highest quality possible. So from there, we're gonna go into our LUTs manager, and it actually comes with a bunch of LUTs from Blackmagic, so you can just turn those on if you want. I'm using my own, actually, that I purchased called the Phantom LUTs, so you can check those out if there's something that you're interested in, but you can also just get the app Apple Log Rec 2020 to Rec 709, or look up any Apple Log 2 conversion LUTs if you want them to be compatible with this most recent. I know this sounds confusing, it's really not. You could just use these built-in Blackmagic LUTs and never have to worry about it again. From there, when we're actually in this record feed, we're gonna click on the LUT button, and we're gonna make sure that this is turned on, and that this button is turned on, because that means it's gonna record it to the clip. From there in our settings, we're gonna choose our main lens, which is the 24 millimeter lens. For FPS, if you want the most cinematic video, we're gonna go 24 FPS. If you want the most social media looking video, video, you're gonna go 30. For shutter, we're gonna go 180 degrees and then we're gonna lock that so that it never shifts or never changes. Then for ISO, this is gonna set every single time depending on how bright or dark our scene is. And then for white balance, what we're gonna do is click the auto button every single time we get in a new scene and then click lock. That will just allow it to automatically select the white balance that's the best and then we lock it back down so it's not shifting while we're recording. From there, you are ready to go and that is how you can get very high quality videos from your iPhone and how we can actually make the videos look just like this. Peace out.